I've been able to do so many things that I've wanted to do and I've been able to fulfill so many of my own dreams that I was at a point where I could, you know, help some others achieve their dreams. How are you today? I knew that I wanted to teach. I, I just had a real desire to give back, but I felt like I didn't know what I could teach. And then it was almost like my question was answered when I found Art of Elysium. So it was like, you can give exactly what you know. So I met Jackie. She's so funny. She's so smart and so sweet. I came in to make a movie trailer with her, and she got to pick the genre. She got to pick the characters. Like, she had total control. She was the writer, director, producer. The Art of Elysium is a organization that helps heal the world through art. Kids in hospitals and prisons and schools, people who are struggling, you know, to find a joy can get that through art. I mean, if filmmaking can be useful in that way, I think it's it's beautiful. Now the organization is expanding into elderly care homes and prisons, so it's just getting bigger. Take one. James wanted to work with Art of Elysium because it allows us to create this amazing synergy to work with emerging artists who can create their work, create their art, and give it right back to the charity and right back to the community. James had told Nina that he had these short stories that he wanted her to adapt. The movies were based on stories that I'd written. The movie is called Memoria, and I co-directed it with my really good friend, Nina Lieri. And I thought Nina and Vlad had the right sensibilities to adapt that material. Then the idea was to raise money for the film, and all profits would go to Art of Elysium. Essentially, the people that helped support the films were giving to charity as well. I did a lot of my early work with Art of Elysium at a children's hospital for critically ill children, and we would put on shows with them, I would write shows with the children, and a lot of it was just being there with them, spending time. When I first met her, she was a little shy, quiet, didn't really know what to say, and by the end, she was, you know, saying, like, cut, action, like, do this, do that. Drop it off, you want to get <laughs> And suddenly come to life like they're so excited to create, to make things. And I need to be able to find that too, always, you know. I had so much fun with her. I'm gonna come back again, make a horror film with her. She's really excited about it.